I'd like to thank everybody for tuning in to like the uh, the blunder stuff I had put up the last four days. I'm kind of surprised that as many people did. Usually when I put up like a blunder tutorial or uh, just a blunder presentation, you know, uh, folks might look at the first one and go, okay, you know, I like that first one, but anything I follow up, I don't need to know that information. And from what I saw here, I'll generally a lot of people uh, in comparison with my other videos tune in to some of the, the, the Splendor shots there and just keeping up with what I was doing. What do you think about that? Is that something that you'd like to see more? Does it uh, help increase your, your desire to get into 3D like graphics and you know, get into like uh, doing 3D models and everything? I'd like to know. So go ahead and put it in the comments if you like. If you, you like seeing that kind of stuff, it is something that I'll probably get quite a bit more into. If not that, I'll show kind of the result of things. Because I'm more than happy to do it, and it really does stretch out the vlogs quite a bit. Everything that I put in that Blender presentation, I did in one night. I just didn't realize that it took so long, the files were so long that I would have to break it up into four days. I hope everybody enjoyed that. Uh, we'll see what we can do next week. I've been thinking about uh, adding on to one, my fourth channel uh, that I developed about a month ago, but I haven't put any videos up on yet. And if that's the case, uh, this fourth channel that I'm doing is uh, two-dimensional. It's not 3D, but I can place up the type of models, the you know, like the graphics and everything, in a 3D format with barely any, any problem at all. And in doing that, I would like to maybe do a behind the scenes uh, with, a, you know, what I'm trying to do there. And then the finished graphic, I would put into 3D on this channel, but the actual video would be on that channel. And that's kind of what I'm kind of going along the lines of thinking here. Spy Kids 4, flop. <laughs> uh, Conan 3D and Fright Night 3D. Bright Night 3D, I hear, was supposed to be a better movie than Conan. Both of them flopped at the film, at the film house there. Um, and so once again, we have this uh, chick flick, uh, The Help, doing, you know, well. So, hey, everyone go out on a date with your significant other or something and watch that movie. It's not in 3D and it's a chick flick. Blech. Hope everybody has a good night and I'll uh, talk with everyone tomorrow.